Hi, this is Phil North from Ferret Software. We have two software applications that can assist you in automating your accounts payable invoice processing. One is ScanWatcher. There are almost 200 Finance One users currently using ScanWatcher uh, very effectively. So it's been around for a while, works very well, highly automated. The other one is ETU, which stands for Electronic Transaction Utility. This is a brand new application uh, just recently released. ScanWatcher. ScanWatcher gives you the ability to link a scanned image of a paper invoice to various locations in your financial system and thus be able to access that invoice image in just a few seconds. The extra work required is simply to attach a pre-printed barcode label to the first page of the invoice, enter the barcode number into the financials, typically using an infrared handheld gun, barcode gun, and then bulk scan the invoices all in one batch, not one at a time, but the whole lot in one go. This is a Finance One screen. This is the field where you enter the barcode number when you've entered the details of the invoice. So simply using a gun, it'll automatically enter that number for you. If you want to look up that image, you go to the inquiry screen, and over here you have an image view option. You tick that image view button and the image of the invoice then appears on your screen. You can also access the image from a number of other locations such as your EIE inquiry screen as well as your XL1 reporter writer. So when you have an attachment link there you simply click on that and it opens the image of the invoice. This is very beneficial for management and auditors to be able to look up an invoice in just a few seconds with a single mouse click. What ETU does is give you the ability to link a PDF invoice that you've received by email to the same locations that ScanWatcher has saved the scanned paper images. Again, doing this in a few seconds. In addition, however, it also can extract an XML or a CSV data file for you to then import into your financials, thus eliminating the manual keying process. The extra work required, you simply drag the PDF from the email into the ETU Drag It In Desktop folder. ETU automatically recognizes that invoice, uses the appropriate map, extracts the XML and CSV, and saves it to a directory for you to then import into your financials. It's very fast and completely eliminates the need to manual key the data. Once it's in your financials, you then code and approve it. Here are some examples of some emailed invoices that have come in with the associated attached PDF. Now typically what you'd simply do is take that PDF and drag it to the drag it in folder on your desktop. I have opened this folder just to make it more visually understandable. Over here is the destination directories for the XML or the CSV files for importing into your system and here is the PDF directory which is the same location that ScanWatcher is saving the scanned images of the paper invoices to. So all you have to do is simply drag that invoice into the drag it in folder. Within a few seconds ET will pick it up and already it's already picked that up, identified which map to use, mapped it out, and here is an XML file of the data that I wish to extract from that Vodafone invoice. It can also be a CSV file and I can now import this data straight into uh, the financials. Over here is in a separate directory in the same location as the, the scanned images of paper invoices is the PDF. Now what we've done here is rename the PDF to information relating to what this is all about because quite often this doesn't really tell you anything. Yeah, it's got the invoice number, but it doesn't tell you who it's from or anything like that. So we have taken data from within the PDF and renamed it. So here is the Adobe PDF invoice. Now this complies with the uh, appropriate tax authorities, IRD or whoever, uh, where you keep this original PDF for seven years, just like you can keep the scanned image of a paper invoice for seven years and get rid of the paper. In this case, you're keeping the original PDF. Now, if you go through your financials, you can then access this PDF the same way you access the scanned paper invoices, through the data entry screen or through various reports. 
So it's that simple. You simply grab the PDF, drag it in here. It'll then split it into an XML or CSV as well as a PDF. So here's some more examples here. I'll just grab that and pull it into here. And here's another one or two. And I'll pull that into there as well as this one and keep pulling them in. And this particular invoice here is one PDF, but it's made up of about 10 invoices. So as I'm throwing them in here, over here are my XMLs and my PDFs. And this one's a big one, so it'll take a few seconds longer. And bang, there it is. There's all the data files ready to import. Here are the PDFs already saved to the same location as the scanned paper invoices. Now, part of this XML is the file name of, this X of the PDF, which is the same. So basically what happens is that the file name of the PDF is put into the same location as the barcode number is put into for the paper invoice. You simply drill down, open it up. That simple. It eliminates the manual keying and the significant amount of manual input required. So a quick review of the benefits. View any invoice in seconds. Doesn't matter whether it's the PDF or the scanned image. Uh, you can find any invoice in just a few seconds. Drill down and open it up. This is very, very important for management and auditors where they want to have a look at something. They're querying something. Uh, takes only a few seconds. Because both the PDF and the scanned paper image are electronic, you can then route them for approvals. As a consequence, you never lose or misplace an invoice again. You don't have to send the paper around for getting approvals. You're sending an electronic version. You significantly reduce the manual keying required. This is quite significant. And if you're not getting a lot of PDF emailed invoices at this point, you simply contact your suppliers and ask them to change the preference on their accounting system, which should be able to send you a PDF emailed invoice uh, without any problem on their part. They should be quite happy to do that because they'll save printing and postage. You provide real-time financial information for management. Uh, very important. You eliminate invoice processing bottlenecks. Uh, typically you'll get an invoice in late. It's got to be paid by a certain date. Uh, in this case you're being able to process them, get them into the system much much faster, eliminating the bottleneck. You eliminate the paper filing requirements. You don't need to save the paper anymore if it's been scanned or if it's in a PDF form. Uh, so you reduce your paper storage. The important thing is both ScanWatcher and ETU cover both the paper and PDF invoices, so it's covering all aspects of your invoicing system. And that's a major, major benefit for one package to be able to do this. If you're interested, contact your Technology One rep or Phil North at Ferret Software. Thanks very much.